Once again, my fellow viewers, I'm Theresa Miria and welcome to the 46th episode of House and Home. Before we go any further on tonight's program, let me share with you a quote. It's become one of my favorites and I thought it would be kind enough to make known to you all. Well, it reads, if you have health, you probably will be happy. And if you have health and happiness, you have all the wealth you need, even if it's not all you want. Anyways, moving on to tonight's program, House and Home brings you a great lineup and they are shopping with Brian Bell. Healthy Minds with Dr. Ambi, Travel with House and Home broken into two parts, plus Belong Yumi and Animal Plus. So without further ado, here's Shopping with Brian Bell. Enjoy. I'm Jane Takilala and welcome to Shopping with Brian Bell. I'm actually here at the St. John Guy Stadium for the Sports Expo. The PNG Sports Exhibition was launched by the PNG Sports Foundation, giving various organizations and federations throughout PNG to showcase their respective codes. The exhibition, being the first of its kind, will run for three days and will showcase various opportunities available to both spectators and organizations. So basically it's an educational and fun event where you get to learn more about the various sporting clubs in the country and where else do you go to get genuine sporting equipment and gear? Where else? Brian Bell. So let's go in and check out some of the world's best brands that Brian Bell supplies. Mary Naga. I'm from the PNG Sports Foundation. I'm the marketing and sponsorship manager. Um, we're here at the Sports Expo. It's the first of its kind expo and we're looking forward to, to this event. So basically the, the idea was to promote and um, provide information for sports. And you know, normally information on sports is really lacking. And what better way to get that information from the experts themselves? Um, and we wanted to target the, the school kids. So we're really looking forward to it. So it's the first of its kind and we want to make it bigger and better the next time. Brian Bell has always been the proud supplier of genuine brand sporting goods with an extensive assortment in stock. No matter what sport you're involved in, Brian Bell caters for the whole range. Brian Bell has shown the commitment by playing a key role in this year's 15th Pacific Games. Through their goal sponsorship, by providing essential products and equipment to the various sporting and accommodation facilities. We have genuine brands available in the likes of Gilbert, Nike, Wilson, Steden, Puma, Adidas, Yonex, Reebok, Buffalo Sports, Canterbury, Mikasa, and many more. Good morning, everyone. My name is Nelly McClay. I'm a sports commissioner, member of the Sports Foundation Board. I represent the Sports Foundation Board in the PNG Games Council. And as far as I'm, I know, and my knowledge is that we've bought a lot of equipment from Brian Bell. And next year, West New Britain is hosting 
in 2016. So we will be spending a lot of money with Brian Bell in terms of purchase of equipment, sports equipment. Hi, I'm Thomas. I like soccer, so I come and buy my soccer equipment here. My kids are on PNG. If you want to come and buy your equipment here, come to Brian Bell. Hi, my name is Lua Rikis and I'm a member of the PNG Peppers. Um, I'm at the Expo here and I'm at the Brian Bell tent. And uh, the netball team, we get cones, whistles, stopwatches from Brian Bell. So if you want netball stuff, you can go down and visit the shop at um, Boroko and the home centre where you can buy your Gilbert netball balls, cones and shoes and all your sporting needs. Hi, my name is Sheila and I love Puma brand and I'll get my Puma brand at Brian Bell. Hi viewers, I'm Pai Shield and Passes from May New Guinea. I'd like to remind you all to go to Brian Bell and every time you shop, please show your New Guinea destinations card. And basically every time you shop, you earn points. Before I wrap up, congratulations to our week four winners who have participated in our Brian Bell Home Center Christmas giveaway promotion. So remember, 50 kina will get you into the draw and you might just be the lucky winner for the grand prize. Make sure you grab a Christmas catalog and shop to win this Christmas. Now you know you can tend to us simply because you're backed up by Brian Bell's warranty, service and spare parts. So remember, great products, great prices, that's Brian Bell! There you go viewers, Brian Bell Sports Expo. Don't miss out on the great surprises. Make the time to drop by and have a look around. I guarantee you, there are a lot of great products with affordable prices. We'll be back with more after the break. Welcome back. Anxiety is one of the main factors that contributes to an ongoing stress in human mentality. Healthy Minds with Dr. Ambi will give you more in detail. So please listen carefully and take note. This is Healthy Mind with Dr. Ambi, proudly brought to you by Telecom PNG Limited. Hello viewers, welcome to our Healthy Mind episode again. Well, this evening, and me, Hamamas Law, we one time you plug again. Law talks are a low one plug, good plug topic where you, me, can educate him, think, think, blow you, me, now stop good law, life, blow you, me. What is the topic? It's all about anxiety and related disorder. What can we talk about anxiety? Time we talk anxiety law, law term, law or medical term. Some people line asking me, hey, one am kind this law word here. Yeah? Now let me talk about anxiety and fear are normal human reactions or emotions to many things which happens in our life. The normal anxiety is what we feel when we are exposed to some kind of external stresses such as losing job or having difficulty in the marriages or children are ill or kind kind problem and come up low life blow you me and can create in one black kind feeling and inside low you now worry. Sometimes me talk talk low peace in or same low worry illness it can be called as anxiety illness. What is again to talk about this anxiety or worry illness is this kind of uh, remain what I mean the sick yeah low and by remain or same time you rouse in this la problem low life blow you you by come hamamas through na feeling good through again so suppose worry a messed up suppose one kind something am causing this la worry you rouse in this la worry but you come back to normal and say hey I'm all right me now all right uh, or worry blow you me and go penis or same this la kind so when this anxiety occurs, then same time, 
it can be affected especially one plus kind fear so what is fear so anxiety worry illness and fear they go hand in hand so what is fear suppose what try blood do come lo fight in you or am like kai kai lo you you feel him or say oh fear am you know fright no could to come up lo you suppose you go lo on top lo mountain and look look lo cliff there look down the soul but you want him something you kiss him am fright no good through am this la kind fright and we call it as fear so these are normal anxiety symptoms they become abnormal so when we talk about anxiety and related disorder time me talk of some disorder am kind sick or some so you know or some normal fear or anxious or worry or this like am normal lo you me lo some like kind problem come am come but when it becomes abnormal you know through through lo why na you me feel him or some am worry come kill him you nothing nothing stop am or some become is also intense this la kind of symptoms and come and am hard lo cope with the day to day life and also am bagarapim activity blo you na wop blo you na passing blo house na all this la kind of something am can cause him one plus kind of painful distress am come up blo you so some la time blo uh, lo term lo you me lo psychiatry or mental health we talk it as generalized anxiety disorder some la kind of fear am come up nothing we call it as phobias and some la time am fear am calm lo dread na you think him or same you by die or this la kind am call all same uh, panic disorders so phobia is irrational and involuntary something am you know through through am make him more same worry am irrational you know through through you must kiss him worry but you kiss him worry nothing am all same fright nothing am call phobia sudden expected un terror like or same terror am come up or same expe- unexpected terror am come up or same now you close to die because there is no real danger but some plus something you think him or same danger am come up or same uh, panic disorder so what how what are the signs and symptoms of all these things what happens you can't when you have a disorder worry disorder you come up also we cannot concentrate we become irritable we tend to sleep but you are still tired but these are psychological symptoms so what do you feel in body time you kiss him anxiety disorder one or same heart rate blow you by increase or same palpitation if you feel him or same heart blow you pounding go go you know or same uh, feel him blow heart beat blow you tension but you feel him or same you know good blood uneasy feeling and your hands will start sweating now by you sweat no good through now breathing too by increase you by kiss him with nothing nothing hurry up do you by I feel him dizzy na fainting you like faint or same na indigestion you know kai kai you know na you know digest so you feel him or same pain lo bell headache na dry mouth you because fright them kiss him you yeah so dry mouth and also some like time you like go hurry up hurry up lo piss piss also you will feel feeling of uneasiness feeling of something terrible is about to happen unpleasant sensation of dread and also feeling worry and poor concentration and at work and what you play on so on so viewers we have learned about signs and symptom of worry illness it is very common so we need to be uh, understand something it is treatable and curable so we we'll, let's find out what causes worry illness let me tell you when uh, because of the social changes and issues which is happening in our life what happens we are going through a lot of stress in our lives so stress and depression and all of same brother sister and i'm come kissing worry nothing nothing lo life blow you so there are external causes that is like car accidents trauma like violence job job loss or time you go to a job interview you look look lol superior and start worry no good through going for exams you know those are new but also loss of loved one and physical illness suppose you are uh, diagnosed to have something you know right lol life blow you this also can precipitate low worry sickness or worry illness and something personal factors is life changes 
you may life blow you you know stuff was same same all the time life blow you me too by change so there are life changes which happen and sometimes is a it can be mimic some heart problems it can mimic some like lungs problem so you don't have to worry what you are learning here for us to understand so you can fight in this last sick not come up good through so these are some of the causes which can make you uh, nothing low sick low this la worry illness and it's only when you go through the worry illness or anxiety disorders or related disorder it does not only worry you plata solia na pusat suffering this la it can also have impact on others in the family so that's anxious is a you know it makes people fearful and also make the others in the family because people in the house don't know you have an issue because it's not like major mental illness you savvy or some something in wrong lob kurblo you me but this is become part of your life the way you behave people in the family will think hey am something wrong lo this la mano mary or pikinini is important you must get to know what it is because it can also have effect on your productivity at work you may not because constantly you're worrying you're not doing your own work at workplace and you can be irritable angry anxious with people and tensed and also fighting with people and frightened and lack of understanding within the family or friends at work can cause other unnecessary issues and you might even lost job because you're not understanding what's going on well how can we help these people number 1 is take take note of it talking about the problem it's simple you have to look for a trustworthy not for gossip and gossip mongering and make it an issue out of it trustworthy people or friends or pastors or priests or doctors and why we look at them and trustworthy we can talk about the issues get their opinions and get some other help because the moment you talking about it you can even heal half it through and if there is another issue we can go ask more help that is talking therapy or talking about the problem number 1 number 2 psychotherapy this is like a intense talking therapy because the therapists are trained before you know same all can do or just for a course and you can do it is a very long term course uh, where the counselors or psychotherapists are trained to give a intense talking therapy it's like recognizing the problem understanding the problem and once a week or once in two weeks or twice a week or something you meet the therapist and you find out what exactly wrong and you're finding a problem solving issues that means fighting this la problem low rationalizing things number 3 is learning to relax well viewers let me tell you techniques there are very many techniques yoga unwinding deep like br- deep breathing exercise like a t- taking a deep breath holding on count 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 and breathe out do it for 10 minutes in the morning and afternoon can relieve tension and deep muscle relaxations these are some of the way you can learn to relax and i'm sure you can google or ask your good friends they can help you with that number 4 for is medi- medications that most of the time we give antidepressants many things antidepressants can cause dependence or addicted to this medicine no god em lik lik time tasol you me by helping lo rouse him this lavori sickness na me pla by stopping this marsin so short term you can give antidepressants and long term also so doctor only by prescribing this marsin you know not by him something lo road na about na kai kai this la kai marsin go lo look him all doctor finally behavioral therapy that is the a form of uh, self help that is means returning to the frightening situation suppose you met him car accident you can't drive anymore get back to the uh, situation and also f- that frightening situation and which can be avoided you bring the patient back to that and keep them until making sure that anxiety goes down you am got not a kind kind way lo help him but one thing i want to tell viewers anxiety disorder disorder illnesses or anxiety disorders can be treatable and it is common we c- we see it in many of our patients most of the time it's gone unseen and it actually bagarim you na our family or workplace so if you have this kind of issues always ask help try to do what i have done no god asking help because you can be always healed from that and have a beautiful life and good health 
Well, viewers, until next time, me talking one name something, put him Papa God first. Emmy God, big blood, thrive blood physician, and can heal him you time you me hear him this last story straight away. So he put him in tap, na pray, na kiss him hell, na stop good. Until then, bye bye now. This is Healthy Mind with Dr. Ambi, proudly brought to you by Telecom PNG Limited. Anxiety and related disorders, such a great topic. So viewers, one of the most important things that I picked out is how you can get rid of anxiety. That is, you simply share your problems with people who will help you solve them and not with people who will use it as an advantage to go up against you. After the short breather, we join Godwin Eki on the first part of Travel with House at Home. Hello everyone and welcome to this edition of Travel with House and Home. I'm Godwin Eki here to show you another edition of where we are today only on travel. Now thanks to PNG Air, the official carrier for Travel with House and Home. And today we're here in beautiful Kimbe at the Walindi Plantation Resort and there is so much to see. So why don't you come with me and let's see what Walindi Plantation Resort has to offer. Established in 1983, Walindi Plantation Resort is situated on the shores of Kimbe Bay on the islands of East New Britain of Papua New Guinea. When it comes to accommodation, Walindi Plantation Resort offers 12 traditional style self-contained bungalows, all spread along the ocean front and surrounded by nature's very own rainforest gardens, with eight plantation house rooms. Bungalows facilities include ensuite, large windows, ceiling fans, tea and coffee making facilities and private verandas to serenade yourself while overlooking the beach. The heart of the resort provides a social hub for you and your friends providing tropical area reception, bar and lounge area, sound deck and a swimming pool to cool off right in the middle of the resort. The resort caters up to a small number of guests, meaning you receive an undivided attention, but yet you're captured in the middle with freedom of choice to move around freely. The resort provides a comprehensive library area for those interested in history and information about diving and nature around the Kimbe Bay, as well as providing wireless internet connection. looking for something to do well there's always free Wi-Fi available here at the Walindi Plantation Resort so make use of it.
that was the first part of travel with house and home showing the Walindi Plantation Resort located in Kimbe in the West New Britain province of Papua New Guinea, one of the places you might want to visit for holidays. Well, obviously, that is where Godwin Eki had the privilege to visit and enjoy its comfort and the amazing view. The second part will be shown at the end of the program, so don't go anywhere. When we come back after the break, we find out what Plesbilla Yumi and Animal Plus will be featuring. From the islands to the highlands, down to the coastal areas of Papua New Guinea, there are exceptionally different types of customary practices and the lifestyle of the people are unique as well. And the fact that there are over 800 different languages, the traditional dances and the attires are totally different and are highly distinctive. Hi, this is Flash Bilong Yumi, I'm Theresa Miria and thank you for joining me. I'm here at the National Museum and Art Gallery in the Masterpiece Gallery as well. Now, let's take a look around this beautiful place and see what's gonna be featured for now. Come on, let's go look around. We address them lo Tari lo Ella province na emi Karas lo Olman. Time lo make him only address em young club boy emi stab lo seven years old emi lose mama. Logan na gosta wan the power Logan Lausman. Okay, time boy reach him twelve years old em lose him papa emi gosta lo Narva group lo Lausman wan the mol omla man osta koli molet Aroli Aroli emo line all bachelors all man ino at Mary. I'm stop one time more early go, and I'm so go. Time I'm reaching 18 years. I'm go stop one time Narbla group or early yet or Narbla's campsite again. This level early campsite I'm able grow in grassy mas kama big log kada. So time I'm stop lo camp. This level early no so all I'm all mangi lo run lo kanya nap. Only got all rules to list stop. So why be any more rules na? You know na ba gumbla swa. So rule rule ika tumbla plant, tumbla ginger ulsa planim. Ajila ginger isa telim. So pas money wogi maswa. Em ginger ba telim. Ajila ul aroli ya guardian blogen osem. Money ka taswa lo a chrome grass blogen so. Em ba ask him ajila mangi lo kam na ba ask him em one gan wrong em make him. Okay, time boy I reach him 25 years old now, I'm grass blogging he come a big club too. So grass is a go, go side side. Not one side, grass is a go one side or same. Not one side, grass is go another side. So also I see little stick of mambu, also sabi put in one side or same. By grass still go one side, not one side, mambu tool put in another side. They have blogging. Grass is go still in another side. So over the time, this is all early money, all so look at them all like that. Only so give them all water and a kai kai. So lo one blood day, I'm also also drink five la bamboo water. Lo one blood day, so so bamboo water, I'm also man also look at them all like that. Also call them all like early lo top less tari. So only so walk in some lo magic top top, no also give them all water na. No at nabla water lo drink, almost drink water also lo contain that also. Okay, time me. Boy, I want to go grass blogger, and I'm ready to start to go back and go online. I'm a blogger. I'm a guardian, 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 I'm a 
So there's a time when money is ready, I come out, and I go back in the whole family blog, and I go stop. So all family blog, not by Kishim, Maki Wambla Meri blog, not by Tupla Maretna stop. So time Tupla is still up, Meri Bakam still up, Pantem Boya. So man is like guardian blow, once I look at the grass blog, and I become Laos, before the Tupla by Silip na Maret. I am cutting grass low and I put him on the same place where we are in time when we see like grass low and bilas. So actually, it's like grass and low, uh, bilas, long uh, air, time only go sing sing, or mariti meri, now only walk him common session. Okay, I got a triple type old grass, one well, long call him mandari, mandari and grass low better paradise was tap and tap, now I'm grass long and red, all painting low red plus well. Manda sinem M two M grass longer in red. That's all put in grass low. Muru kantap M manda sin na manda mini M black black grass M pure grass. So it's a black black grass M all uh, painting man them black circle na crystal pink. So time lo Danis M front row as M all uh, manda arriba kopas online got better paradise further zone but all front line. All middle line by all mada sin, I got muru grass na all black uh, grass all mada medium by style of backside. So grass em, uh, so red, red grass em, man na merit want to show him. So all merit by, and by at least by tupla lo backside lo line by Dennis na by all style of backside na wear him. Uh, mada, mada sin, just like grass he got, uh, address he got muru grass lo wear. Hi everyone, this is Animal Plus with House and Home. I'm Teresa Miria and I am so glad you could join me. I'm here at the RSPCA of Papua New Guinea and we'll be looking at pet adoptions. Now let's go find out which pets are up for adoption. Come on, let's go. The RSPCA of Papua New Guinea was established with a mission to prevent cruelty to animals through community education and promoting and providing animal care and protection. The adoption program gives the less fortunate members of our community a second chance at a good life. The five basic freedoms involved in taking care of a pet, and not just for pets, but for all creatures, great and small, domestic animals, farming animals, and wild animals. The five basic freedoms are freedom from hunger and thirst, freedom from fear and distress, freedom to enjoy normal behavior, freedom from injury and disease, and freedom from discomfort. Hi, my name is Valentina. I've been a volunteer with RSPCA since 2008. This is my eighth year of volunteering. Over the years, I've adopted um, a couple of animals, pets, and just recently I've adopted a dog, Boss. Um, the main reason why I started uh, adopting animals was not just because of my love for animals, but also because of the empathy I had for animals, just seeing them in the um, shelter homes, just wanting to have a family uh, really touched me. So I knew I had to do something about it, you know, just to make a difference in at least one of these animals' lives. So yeah, that's why I uh, decided to start adopting. So my first adoption was in 2009, and since then, I've adopted two or three, and yeah, the latest one, as I mentioned earlier, was Boss. So now I have uh, a Boss and another cat also, so yeah. Uh, 
there, there are a lot of benefits actually. Um, you, you can do a lot of research about it. You'll, you, you can read about it. But the main benefits that I've seen personally would be um, physically, uh, physical health. They help you. They help you run around a lot, do exercise. You know, they're all they're really playful. So that's what they they mainly make you do: stand up, jump, run. Apart from that, they're really good as companions because they help ease stress, anxiety, depression. They help ease loneliness. So all in all, they help with your mental health also. So and they're good with they're good for kids also because they teach um, children lifelong lessons such as caring, sharing, to have em empathy for other living beings and also for um, yeah just a sense of responsibility so they teach children that so it's very good for them to adopt the pet you first have to fill in an application form the form is then screened Recommendations are then made by the management to make their final decision. The applicant then follows up with RSPCA the next day on the outcome of their application. If the form has been approved, the applicant visits daily in order to start the bonding with the pet which will be prepared by the RSPCA team to hand over to the applicant. And finally, the applicant merrily takes the pet home. All right, my friends, pet adoptions right here at the RSPCA. If you are a pet lover, why don't you come on down to RSPCA and they will help you find a best friend. Until next time, thank you for joining me on Animal Plus. I'm Theresa Miria. Goodbye. For those that live and breathe nature, Walindi Plantation Resort offers a variety of tours around the resort and around Kimbe. Local tour guides can take you on an adventure on the land to see Kimbe sunset on the top of the mountains, bed watching, a drive tour in the middle of oil palm plantation, hot springs up in the jungle and even a tour in the village to know more about local traditions and culture, walking tours, volcano tracks and more, making you stay as adventurous throughout your holiday. But if you're someone that loves what lives beneath the ocean, Walindi Plantation Resort can give you exactly that. Also known for the best in the world diving sport, Walindi Plantation Resort can take you down the ocean to see some of the best corals and beautiful sea creatures that would make you want to stay more at Walindi Resort, making it your home away from home. If you're on the boat, always look around to see if you can spot some dolphins around. At the comfort of your convenience, Walindi Plantation Resort can assure you good company, great food, friendly staff and relaxed atmosphere where nothing can go wrong. Yeah, so Walindi Plantation Resort, um, we're located just 20 minutes out of Kimbe Town. Uh, we're a scuba diving resort primarily, 
but we're also you know a fantastic destination for bird watching. Uh, we also have a lot of land-based activities, uh, tours that we offer in the local surrounding area. Um, and we're also you know a great spot for business clients who just want to get out of town and come and stay out here as well. Um, the vast majority of our clients are international tourists, uh, most of them coming from Australia. Uh, Japanese market's quite big for us as well. Uh, but primarily the main attraction here is the scuba diving. You know, we've been here for, for over 30 years as a resort. Um, you know, it's, it, it's not just a resort, it's, it's, it's morphed into we're part of the local community. It's, it, you know, it's almost like a little village. We're surrounded by villages. Uh, Willindi itself is, you know, we're a big property, so we, we're, we're like a small village as well. Um, you know, and we, we, we always work with the local communities. Uh, we try and develop local tourist sites that we take our guests to. We pay fees to the local landowners for access. Um, so they, everybody benefits from tourism. Um, and West New Britain, you know, when people talk about Kimbe, West New Britain, they all think, oh, West New Brit uh, Oil Palm Province. But there's so much more here. There's so much um, potential. There's so much to see here. Papua New Guinea, it's not the sort of place you go to for mass tourism. You're not going to have your mega resorts and you go lie on the beach. PNG is, tourism in PNG is niche products. So you're, you're diving, you're bird watching, you're trekking, you're surfing, um, you're fishing. That's, that is what PNG will excel in. And that's what PNG has some some of the best products in the world. We, we, got, we can compete with anybody in the world with our products. But again, there's a, there are a lot of challenges that we need to overcome, but I, we can do it. We can do it and there is, there is a bright future for tourism in Papua New Guinea. That's the end of our show, viewers. I hope you enjoyed the Walindi Plantation Resort in Kimbe. Make sure you book a stay with Walindi Plantation Resort next time you travel. A very special thank you to PNG Air, the official carrier for travel with house and home. Until next time, thanks for watching Travel with House and Home. I'm Godwin Eki. It's goodbye for now. Alright viewers, this is where I leave you, but before I go, thanks for keeping me company and please don't forget to join us same time, same place here on House and Home. And remember, there's more you can get out for your home and lifestyle improvements when you tune into House and Home every Tuesday. I'm Teresa Miria and as usual, on behalf of the House and Home team, have a pleasant night and a safe week. All about the better man for your life with house and home.